What's up, LA Live gang? This is your boy AC, and welcome to another edition of LA Sports Live. Well, we have a developing and continuing story coming out of the Dallas football camp. Of course, as you guys know, uh, their all pro running back Ezekiel Elliott is in the middle of a holdout slash contract negotiations, and uh, he's not in camp. He's still um, out of country training, and uh, matter of fact, he's training with uh, Marshall Falk as they share the same agent. And anyhow, he's not in camp. So the Cowboys, you, you know, you know Jerry Jones, he's gonna move full steam ahead. Uh, the Cowboys have the luxury of having one of the best O lines in the NFL, and uh, you know I, the way I believe Jerry Jones looks at it as uh, of course he wants Ezekiel back in there. He, he knows he needs Ezekiel, but as far as he's concerned, it's the next man up, and the next man up is going to be uh, Tony Pollard. Uh, Tony Pollard, uh, he's you know the Cowboys have a number of running backs in camp. But he's been above, you know, above and beyond the best one so far in the uh, preseason. Uh, Tony has 15 attempts and uh, he's managed to uh, accumulate 84 yards. And that's an average of 5.6 yards per carry, which is, of course, you guys know that's great. And uh, he has one touchdown. Now, uh, I think the, the, excuse me, the Cowboys have known pretty much who they're going to end up going with if Ezekiel doesn't come in to camp as far as being a starter. So he's only had 15 carries. They've kind of spread the ball around because, of course, you know, they want to protect their best players. But, uh, you know, like I said, he's far and above the best one that they have. And I think the the, uh, Cowboys are pretty comfortable with uh, him starting the season off as their uh, leading running back. Matter of fact, Jerry Jones made a statement the other day. You know, you guys know he always has something slick to say. That uh, he said, "Hey, it's you know, it's pretty obvious Ezekiel's gonna miss some time, and I think that's gonna be great for us because we'll have we'll have him fresh for the playoffs." So, you know, Jerry's been around a long time. He's been through these things, uh, you know, many times, and uh, he doesn't seem to be too too worried. You know, uh, you guys know pretty much Jerry. And uh, Jerry Jones and Robert Kraft, the owner of the uh, New England Patriots, they pretty much run the league. You know, those two are the, the two most powerful uh, owners in the league. But anyhow, uh, if you look at the uh, the Cowboys' first five games, you know, <laughs> he has good reason to be, you know, not worried. If you look at their, their, their first game, week one, they're going to play the Giants. The Giants are starting the rookie quarterback, so that should be a win. Week two, they'll face Case Keenum and the Washington Redskins. That could go either way, but let's say they win that game. They're starting off the season 2-0. Next week, should be they'll be facing, uh, week three, they'll be facing the Dolphins and uh, Ryan Fitzpatrick. That should be another win. So right there, they're sitting at 2-1. and one. Uh, the, the next week, they'll play the Saints. Uh, that'll be a loss. That's two and two, and then the next week they're going to be playing the Packers, and I believe they can win that game. So the Giants could—I mean, excuse me—the Cowboys could very easily start at three and two, or even possibly four and one. So uh, they have reason to be confident. You know, these are just what's going on now is just contract negotiations. Uh, there'll be a lot of bit, a lot of back and forth, but as you guys know. Uh, the Cowboys, I don't think they're going to cave because they still have to sign Dak Prescott. His contract is coming up. They're co- co- currently negotiating uh, with him. And next season, they're probably going, they're going to have to pay their wide receiver, Amari Cooper. So, like I said, this is just negotiations. There's going to be a lot of back and forth. And um, overall, I don't think Cowboy Nation, I don't, I don't think you guys are really, really worry either uh, you know they have a lot of faith in the team and um, you know they pretty much follow example that Jerry Jones you know uh, puts forward and that's the next man up and you know all this other BS uh, you know how about them Cowboys anyhow 
This is AC, LA Sports Live. Holla at you guys on the next one.